You ready? Coach Dan Mullen is outside your door here. It is. <laughs> this is my daughter Kelly Walker. For Kelly Walker, a congenital heart patient at Batson Children's Hospital, meeting Mississippi State football coach Dan Mullen was a big thrill. Very nice to meet you. Thank you. Okay, I'm, I'm, nice to meet you. I'm glad you're, you're doing Thank good. You. Yeah. High five. And she wasn't alone. Yes. <laughs> 20-month-old Wilkes Carter and his father, Casey, were just as thrilled to welcome the Bulldogs coach, his team, and other MSU athletes to the state's only children's hospital. My son, Wilkes Carter, um, he's diagnosed with Langerhans cell histiocytosis uh, when he was 10 months old. He's 20 months old now, and uh, we've been here at Blairy Batson from the get-go and have been really pleased with everything. and. Uh, Really excited to see Mississippi State's players and their head coach and cheerleaders and a volleyball player come through it. Uh, I think Wilkes has had a really good day. I, I'm a big believer if, you know, we're in a position and, and very fortunate that by coming we can put smiles on people's faces. And uh, I, I'm a big believer if you can put a smile on, on a young kid's face, you really should be obligated to do that. And, and these kids, to, I mean, the families that are here, and it, it means so much to us to, to just maybe put a smile on their face and, and all the tough things they're going through to make them happy for even just a couple minutes. Oh, that's what we like to hear. Uh -huh. We got to get, see, now you're the TV star, but you know you're probably the superstar on the floor anyway. Huh? Well, last time we were in the hospital, we were having a baby. So, How long ago was that? Two and a half months ago. Really? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Really? So when you have oh, yeah. little ones of your own, you think about how lucky you are. So this is actually the first time I've ever been here, and that's exactly why. Yeah. We're just kind of here trying to give back and uh, just basically here to put a smile on some of these kids' faces. I mean, they, they support us, so we're trying to support them and just do anything we can for them. So, did this make your day? Oh, totally. <laughs> <laughs> nice to have visitors when you're in the hospital. Mm, it is. Especially tall guys. <laughs> You always have a good reception here, but it seems like there were a lot of state fans this year. <laughs> it was good, yeah. It seems like not some state fans here, and it, it seems like we're kind of uh, a lot of the hospital staff. We're invading the hospital staff as well, because it looks like we had a lot of state fans within the hospital. My dad was there, I think he was 68 to 71 or 69 to 72, but he was there four years. And he, did he play football? He did. He was defensive tackle. And I graduated from there. My mom went there. Whole family is startful, born and bred. We love the Bulldogs. Go State. Yes, we are all Mississippi State fans, and we are so excited that they took time to come see the kids today. Odd to find this many alums of any school together in one location. <laughs> yes, we are all Bulldogs. Yo, know, so football season, there's no conflict for you. No, we love Mississippi State. The kids love it. Yeah, it's really great to have the dogs come in. Seems the, the staff loves it too. Yes, <laughs> very much so. This is my third year of the four years uh, Mississippi State's come down here, so I've been here third time around and gets better every time. The guys that come, they just love it and they have a great time. Play all of these right there. And when athletes at the top of their game visit Batson, they play to win. <laughs> well, as you can see right now, Mr. Moore over there has three cards. Caleb Jules is actively pursuing that. He has four left. Daniel Knox right here, big old offensive lineman's in the clubhouse right there with two. It looks like he's one away from the very coveted Uno. This is what you play for. Forget about the Olympics next week. You know, forget about the College World Series last month. Uno right here, right now, is what our Cedar Clark is all about. It's a stressful game, isn't it? Pretty stressful. <laughs> Looking forward to the season. Can't wait. Can't wait to get going. We'll start practice next week, and we're ready to roll. To learn more about Bats and Children's Hospital, go to childrenshospital.umc.edu. I'm Jim Albritton reporting.